Hey everyone, this video is to help those who are running into the error incorrect views.bin. Atmosphere and Fuse need to both be running on the same version or else you're going to run into this error. I'm going to teach you guys how to manually update and make sure your Fuse files match with your Atmosphere. We're also going to update Hikate just because they updated their version as well. So at the top of the page, you're going to see that it says Atmosphere 1.5.4 pre-release. This is a, as it says, a pre-release, so there's still a few kinks here and there. It's up to you if you'd like to download this one. Uh, if you read the description, it has some new updates. Uh, if this is something that you're looking to do, then I would recommend getting this one. But if you're like me and you have 1.5.3, which is the latest one, all you're gonna do is click on our file down here, use.bin. So we're gonna download it. Or if you're 1.5.4 and you're having issues, you can download fuse.bin right here for 1.5.4 up to you so we're going to update hikate as well because they also released a new version so we're just going to download the hikate zip all right we have our switch sd card opened up and and we have our downloads all right so let's start off with hikate we're going to click on the folder and just drag and drop everything that we need it's going to ask us if we want to replace these files in our switch sd yes because we are updating them so we're going to replace them since we are updating Hikate, we're going to need to replace the payload as well because as of that last video, it was 6.03. So for this one, it's 6.0.4. Wherever you have it located, you're going to need to delete that old file and replace it with this one. So for me, I have it in a modding folder. I'm going to delete this one and just drag and replace. Next, we're going to drag the fuse bin file. So the way to do this is go into bootloader payloads and we're going to drag in place and yes we're going to replace this because again we are updating it okay after you do that you're set you're good to go you're going to exit this e and you're going to eject your sd card and plug it into your nintendo switch so for injecting you're going to need to replace the payload with that new one that you did so you're going to select it and you're good to go just repeat the injection process. All right, well, I hope that helped you guys out. Just remember to follow the steps in my how to mod your Nintendo Switch video and your Switch should be up and modded. Thanks again and see you next time.